mine. She is like the ones before me, the ones who gave me their memories. She stands in my mind. She cannot be there, but she is. What others? The Emperor demanded. What is this nonsense? The old woman straightened, lowered her pointing hand. I have said too much, but the fact remains that this child who is not a child must be destroyed. Long were we warned against such a one, and how to prevent such a birth, but one of our own has betrayed us. Though Paul married Irulong, his concubine Chani, a Fremen woman, was his true love. She bears Paul two children, Leto II, named for Paul and Elia's father, and Ganema, whose name meant spoil of war. Leto II would go further than even Paul would, and his influence would echo to the edges of time itself. The spice melange is produced by the great sandworms of Arrakis. If they should die, then all spice production would cease. The sandworms are monstrous beings that roam in the deep desert. They attack all rhythmic motions, such as footsteps or the rumbling of spice harvesters. The worm is now beneath the crawler, Kind said. You are about to witness a thing few have seen. Flecks of dust shadow the sand around the crawler now. The big machine begin to tip down to the right. A gigantic sand whirlpool begin forming there to the right of the crawler. It moved faster and faster. Sand and dust filled the air now for hundreds of meters around. Then they saw it. A wide hole emerged from the sand. Sunlight flashed from glistening white spokes within it. The hole's diameter was at least twice the length of the crawler, Paul estimated. He watched as the machine slid into that opening in a billow of dust and sand. The hole pulled back. Gods, what a monster! 